Now then gamers, hope you're well, Skip Pratt here. As always, if you're new, please hit the subscribe and ring the bell. Uh, so yeah, uh, I've been really, really busy this week. Uh, sorry I've not put a lot of uh, uploads up. As I say, I have been back to work. Uh, I was on, obviously, lockdown the three weeks before, so you've had a lot of content. Uh, this is probably my biggest, biggest pickup of not only 2020, but of, of a long time. Uh, I've got a few little bits and I've got some fun bits to show you. Uh, I did I did put them in my collection already. I've made a display out the, out, out the items and I've got a project on the go. So it's all good fun. Stay to the end. You're going to love it. So I'll show you the few pickups. So we've got uh, a Fanatec PS1, PS2 steering wheel. I've got all the pedals and everything with it. I've literally just picked this up today. Uh, this is a little clue. This is going to be from my new section, uh, my new display, my racing display. So yeah, my, uh, my Fanatec, which is a pretty decent make as well. And as I say, I've got all the, the pedals and everything with it. So, you know, it's going to be good in the collection. Uh, and I've just picked up these two games. I've been after this one, uh, which is Star Wars Demolition. So I now have all the Star Wars for all the PS1 games. I've got the full set now on the Star Wars for PlayStation 1. And I have a uh, Worms Armageddon. So that's the first little bit. Now the next bit is a major, major pickup. Uh, I'll show you the, the new display. Uh, it's Resident Evil. I'll show you the display and I'll, I'll explain to you what I've got. So let's pop on over. Here we go then, gamers. So gamers, yeah, this is a new display. You can probably see some new bits, so I'll quickly talk you through uh, what we've got here. So yeah, uh, now I've got a Resident Evil figure at the back, if you can see her. She's there. Uh, I've got another Resident Evil figure. I've got another Resident Evil figure on the pickup. Uh, I picked up this big, big dude. He's from one of the Resident Evil series as well. Uh, some of these parts I've already got on the movies, which I like doing the movies. Uh, this is obviously another Resident Evil figure. Uh, I have the bo I bo I've got the box there for it as well with the candle. Uh, it's 4D, so basically when you're playing the game, it stinks like you're in the Resident Evil game. It's really, really good fun. Uh, my other pickup I got was I got the original Resident Evil 1. I got Resident Evil 2. I got the Nemesis one. And I got uh, Survivor, Resident Evil Survivor, so that was you to pick up. Now the major, major pickup for me, gamers, it's fully complete, it's mint quality, it is a Resident Evil house. I mean, God, I've been after this for so long. Uh, big shout out to the guy that did it for me, thanks a lot, pal. Uh, you know, he, he had a massive, major Resident Evil collection, and he was just uh, downsizing. So, I mean, it's got all the parts of it, it's got the VHS tape, it's got all the poster in the back. There's a really groovy little bit here. Let's see that look. I just love it. It's my favourite Resident Evil game. I'm so lucky games. I've got all the steel kin, gold case. I've got the white one. Uh, I picked up that of him as well, which was the Resident Evil The Dark Side Chronicles. So I mean that that for me is, is a major is a major pickup. You know, it's a huge pickup. Uh, I really do love the section. You'll probably notice a lot of things changing in the game room. It is evolving, it's upgrading, it's changing. Uh, I've, I've sold a few bits this week. I'll tell you that now, gamers. Uh, I'm well over 3,000 games now. Uh, I let about nine to go out my collection, which I uh, I didn't really play or, you know, there was just you know not doing anything for me. I've put the money towards all this slot. As I say, that was a, a, a big, big purchase. Uh, but that that's just, that's gonna stay, you know. I say another Resident Evil one there, so that's that's the first major pickup of the week. Them little bits I pointed out, the rest I already had. So yeah, that's the first, you know, the first major pickup I've had in a long time. I uh, love to hear your comments, but stay to the end. We're not done yet. This is the next phase. The next phase, gamers. So yeah, gamers, you can see I've had uh, my, my fruit machine's gone. Uh, good friend of mine, uh, I've moved it on. He's been after it for a long, long time, and I, you know, I, I sorted him out. He's really, really happy with it. So again, if you're watching, thanks for that, mate, and, and enjoy the machine. Uh, as I say, with the uh, little the little retro corners gone, uh, this is all in actual. It's all in a, a project stage at the minute. It's all going to change. This is the bad boy. I'm doing a full racing simulator setup. Uh, I've got lots of materials on it, you know, it's, it's got a lot of work to be done on it. Uh, again, if the kid's watching for this one, thanks for sorting this out. I, you know, it is a project. It's, you know, it's got top steering wheels. It's got all the seats. It's all going to get cleaned. Uh, now, it's got the the upgraded uh, pedal system. These are the uh, pretty dear ones. I mean, he was explained to me, so he's done me a really good price on it. Uh, the reverse up and it's, you know, like a proper racing clutch and 
and throttle and that. Uh, we've got all this lot as well, look, gamers. So, you know, it's all that lot. We've still got the old section there, look. We've got the uh, the uh, Commodore 64 with all the top games at the front. We've still got the Atari section, which is looking good. It's glowing. So, yeah, this is going to be the new bay. Uh, I'll kind of show you how it's going to look. So, it's going to be like that, if you can see, gamers. We've got a, a big area. I'm going to be doing a new uh, racing display, so we've got Gran Turismo games. I've got all the Gran Turismo games through right from PS1 upwards. So yeah, we're going to have a full, full racing corner. Again, it is a project. I will, uh, I'll keep everybody posted on it. So yeah, really, really excited for it. Uh, I won't, I won't spoil it too much, but yeah, that, that's where we're at, gamers. So thanks for watching. So yeah gamers, that's where we're at, we've, we've got some major changes going on in the game room. Uh, you're probably wondering where the Resident Evil stuff is, where it was up there, where it's gone. The full the full game room is changing, it's evolving. I've got lots to show you, lots to come, there'll be it. Once the the, uh, the simulator system's done, it's all done, it's going to take a few weeks. Uh, we're going to be working on that. As soon as I get the materials, uh, I've ordered lots through internet. I say with all the current situation, we're going to have delays. So. As soon as they all come, I'm going to strip it all down, I'm going to start to build it up, it's, it's going to be a fun project, I've got some very good ideas, so, as always, yeah, stay for it, stay for it, ring that bell, ring that bell, there's going to be loads of updates on this project now, so, and then after it's all done, there'll be a brand new room tour, so yeah, thanks for watching, as always, keep on gaming, cheers gamers.